my hope is that these snow flurries will intensify and I get some like really interesting weather conditions to photograph moose in. Well, hello everybody. How's it going? I'm Steve and I'm out here to photograph some moose. And uh, the reason I'm here right now is because look, there's actually a little bit of snowfall. Uh, it's been weeks since we've had any snow. It's been way too warm and way too dry for my taste as a wildlife photographer in the winter. Uh, but the forecast said like 30% chance of flurries this afternoon. So I pulled myself away from the computer, drove up here, spotted some moose with the binoculars, and now I'm walking out towards them. Uh, so my hope is that these snow flurries will intensify and I get some like really interesting weather conditions to photograph moose in. So uh, I've been spending quite a bit of time with the moose lately. Uh, I did a couple weeks of workshops where we photographed some moose and it was great. Uh, but I'm out here alone today, no clients. It's hard to vlog when I'm doing workshops, you know? It's not really fair to the clients, but uh, the moose have been great. The weather has not been, so uh, we've only been given a couple of decent opportunities in the last few weeks to get uh, moose in the snow, which is one of my favorite things. Uh, so anyway, this was just kind of a, a Hail Mary of 30% chance this afternoon got me all worked up enough to come out here. Hopefully these will intensify. Um, but there's already moose right out there on the horizon. Uh, up moving around. Some of the bulls have lost their antlers already. Our big most impressive or second most, depending on kind of your, uh, what you like out here. Hoback, he uh, dropped his antlers already. So he's not gonna look very impressive out here, but I'll be looking for other nice bulls that are out here. Hopefully I can find some. And if not, I'll just photograph whatever's here. All right, so I'll check back in with you when I've got some moose in the viewfinder. And uh, hopefully we can make a decent vlog out of this. I think we kind of need the moose to cooperate and the weather to cooperate. And we'll do our best. See you in a bit.
here we are. Bull moose, one that's dropped his antlers over there on the left. Uh, none of these are one of the two big, big boys that I was hoping to find out here. I do see a big bull, like probably a half a mile away, way, way, way out there. But anyway, uh, this guy's nice. So I think I'm gonna stick with him for the evening here. He's got like a little slightly smaller pal with him. Maybe they'll uh, get feisty and start to spar a little bit or something. But right now they're just grazing around. Little bit of snow falling, not enough to make it interesting yet. But I'm gonna hang in here till it gets dark and hopefully something good will happen. So I'm out here today with the Nikon Z9 with the 400 2.8 with the built-in teleconverter and then the little um, Sony camera on top that is just kind of shooting the wider scene while I vlog here. And uh, that's all I brought. I did not bring a wide angle with me today. Usually I do because I like these opportunities to photograph wildlife with the Tetons behind them, but the Tetons are all socked in over there. And uh, what I was really hoping for was some snowfall uh, on these moose which may or may not happen, but that's what I'm doing out here. So I'm just gonna stick with, with this big bull here and his pal and see if they give me anything this evening. All right, there's the scene. Hope for something good. Yeah, this is, uh, what do we got? Like a in couple inches of snow here and it, it, there should be a lot more than that out here. So kind of disappointing weather-wise uh, this year. All right, back to the moose. See you later. All right, I kind of lied to you there. It was accidental, but when I told you I was gonna stick with those moose, and then I saw a bigger bull a half a mile out, I just kind of decided I'd go for the bigger moose. So I just started hoofing it. And now I'm all sweaty, but it's snowing a little bit better. And uh, so I'm getting close to the bigger moose out here and uh, do my best to photograph them in what light I have left, which isn't a whole lot. So anyway, I think um, I might not vlog anymore and I might, but if I don't, I'll just kind of show you some of the sights out here and uh, see who we've got. But this looks like a more promising group with a couple of bigger bulls in it. And uh, should be pretty good. And hopefully this snowfall keeps intensifying as well. Anyway, they're right out here. Not that you could see much there, but on the wide angle lens, but I'm getting close-ish. So I'll check in with you in a bit or not. But I like this group better. So I'm gonna focus on them for a little while.
Oh, hi. All right, I'm still here. It's getting dark-ish. Uh, made a couple of decent photos here, but I guess I kind of got exactly what I was hoping for, which is some snow. Um, the moose have mostly just been graze, graze, graze. Not doing a whole lot, but uh, they've given me a couple of decent poses and there was like a little skirmish out here uh, between a couple of the moose. And uh, so it was actually pretty cool, but I'm kind of glad I made it down here. Uh, this bull's more impressive than the other ones that were back there like half a mile. So uh, it was worth hauling butt down here and uh, seeing what I could get out of this. But it's about over. So I'm gonna just kind of hang in here till it's too dark to shoot. Um, so maybe another 15 minutes, it'll be all done. But uh, anyway, I think I got enough to make a vlog today. So that's good, because I haven't made a vlog in so long, I apologize. Just busy, busy, busy doing workshops and kids and life and all that stuff. So um, anyway, I hope you enjoy this one. And uh, I hope I get out and do another one soon. But the uh, the bull moose are going to start dropping, all of them start dropping their antlers soon, so I don't have much time to do more moose, but I'm going to try and get out and maybe do one more before it's all over here. So that's about it. I won't plug anything today. Uh, actually, I take that back. How about join my email list? And uh, I give some updates and like tips and tricks and uh, discounts and workshop announcements and stuff like that. So uh, click the link in the description or just visit my website. And then at the bottom of the page there, there you can uh, just join my email list. I don't bombard you with crap. Uh, I might send out some crap occasionally, but uh, I don't bombard you with stuff. So. Join that if you'd like, and um, I'll see you in the next video. So thanks for watching, and it's good to be back. Take care. See ya. See how we got going on over here. There's my scene, and then there's the moose. That's it. Have a good one.